Hi everyone, I am Girish and today I am going to show you how to create SWOT analysis or matrix in Microsoft PowerPoint. This will be looking like this. Once we click, we will show this trend. Let's go to weakness, opportunities and finally threats. This beautiful animation infographics can be used to show your SWOT analysis for any project, for any organization. So without wasting time, let's create a new one. So to create a new one, we need to go to insert and we need to click insert a blank slide. So this is blank slide but you know when we are going to create it we need to understand that why we require SWOT analysis so SWOT analysis is basically an study undertaken by organization or project management to identify its internal strength and weakness as well as its external opportunities and threats so to create we need to insert a shape, go to insert, go to shape and we are going to insert this which is known as circle hollow. So we are going to create it like this. Yeah, that seems perfect. Let's, yep, that's better. Go here, yeah. So. This is what I was looking for. Now we need to go to insert and we need to enter another shape, go to shape and we need to insert this line or better just insert uh, this rectangle. So we are going to insert a rectangle like this. Uh -huh. So put it here. Perfect. Create a duplicate copy of this. Go to rotate and do it rotate 90 degree and we can make it here. Now what we'll do is we'll go we'll select this or maybe we'll select everything here. Then we'll go to format and we'll go to merge shape and we need to click on fragment. So this picture has been divided in um, you know many parts and we need to remove what we don't require. So we don't require this, this, this and this. Now we need to remove this as well, this as well, this, 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 this. Perfect. Now we are done, pretty done. If we have anything, we can remove it here. Now we'll copy these colors. You can insert those colors from go to insert and we do have like this safe fill options, but we'll use these colors which has already been defined for me. So I'll copy those and we'll go here and paste it. So what I'll do is I'll Fill this with this color. We'll go here. We'll fill this with this color. I will fill this by going eyedropper with this color, and finally this going to say fill eyedropper and fifth one. So all uh, the color which I required has already been filled. Now I'll select all those. Then I'll go to save outline and make it as no outline. So that is what I was looking for. What I'll do is now I need to insert um, another shape, go to shape, and I'll use this. Uh, maybe this. 
So I'll select it here and create a yep. perfect. So I'll fill uh, this by this color and uh, make outline as no outline. So that seems perfect. Maybe I'll increase a bit. Uh -huh. Let's make it to 2. Perfect. And I'll put it back. Send to back. What I'll do is I need to, you know, insert another shape now. Go to shape. And this time I'll go to oval shape. And I'll fill it here. Yep. Perfect. Then I'll do is save outline, no outline. Then I'll duplicate this and create a small shape and I'll fill it with different color. So I'll fill it with this. Perfect. Now we'll do this and I'll select those. Go to home, go to arrange. Align, align middle. Perfect. So it should be like, yes. So that is I what I was looking for. And what I'll do is I'll insert another with this and I'll add this. We insert this and I'll add W for weakness. I'll change this to color this. I'll increase by maybe 40. Change this color to white or maybe 44 would be fine. Yep. Make it bold. Perfect. What I'll do is I'll put this in middle. That seems really good. Now I'll select all these three. Make a duplicate copy. And go here. Make a duplicate copy for this as well. And I go to rotate and rotate it uh, flip vertical perfect so i'll put it here send to back or maybe down yes and i'll select all these and perfect Okay, now go to next one. Let's change it to opportunities O. Okay, then we'll go to copy this, control D go here and what I'll do is I'll go here align and make rotate it with um, flip vertical no that's not flip vertical let's make it uh, I am playing with it and he is playing with me. Rotate 90 degree. Perfect. Let's paste it here. Okay. I'll copy this. Control D. And 
go here perfect make it s that is the strength okay then what i'll do is i'll copy this and make control d and go to arrange flip vertical it will always play with me like this perfect i'll go to rotate again and do this or maybe this yes perfect send it back i can copy this this is not in center i'll copy this my control d and i'll paste it here thus become a thread mm -hmm. thus become a thread okay now we need to you know fill this as per our uh, decided color for this we are going to fill this say fill eyedropper fill it then for this i'll fill it with another color maybe plus 2 with this matter for this i am going to fill say fill eyedropper this tool then i'll go here go to say fill i'll fill it with this okay let's fill it this the say fill um eyedropper yes and i can do that with another colors maybe red perfect for this i'll go to say fill eyedropper i'll fill it with it this i can fill it with another color maybe this yeah that seems perfect now that is what i was looking for now i'll go to insert i'll go to icon and will insert a icon i can here let's insert it so we can increase the size of this perfect and i'll fill this same with aha uh -huh. so that's that's what i was looking for let's select everything control let's select everything whatever we do have and we'll go to shape effect go to preset and we'll select this one so that's look more professional now now we can insert you know uh, the text we can copy from here i don't want to waste time so i can copy all four from here and i can paste it here now as per our requirement we can maybe maybe before doing this what we need to do is we need to select everything and make it to a bit downside yep now we can copy data from here 1 2 3 4 we can copy it and we can paste it here now that's look good even if we require it we can just do it we go here we make it bit downside we make it bit downside yep so our fine we do have these four the strength these are again i can you can use it so i copy these and i paste it here and as per our requirement we can paste it here we can paste it here maybe we can just decrease the size yep so these are these are uh, you know little change we need to do as per our requirement so i think we are almost done only part uh, we are uh, pending with is animations we'll go to animation 
and we go to animation pane and remove everything whatever we do have here so remove this now what we'll do is we go here and we'll um, add this wipe make it uh, from right to left yes this is the first we'll go here now what we'll do is we'll uh, go to here arrange make it group we again select all this arrange make it a group we select all these make it a group we select all these and make it a group now what we'll do is uh, we have already make uh, animation here what we'll do is we'll uh, add another animation to this and that would be a uh, wipe again but this time we want this to go from right to left and it should go after this okay and finally this one we want this to be zoom in and that should come with so that's that's what we have done it then we'll go here what we'll do is uh, again we'll do um, wipe that seems perfect then we'll do this again we'll do wipe this time it should go from left to right and this should we zoom in and it should go with it okay so you can understand this is done uh, this should be after previous perfect we'll go here we'll make animation again wipe this time we want from left and we want this wipe again from left to right and we need this as well we want this to be zoom perfect and this should be after two minutes and this should be with previous the final one this we want again a wipe and they, we want this from right to left here we want again a wipe now we want uh, this from then we'll select this again want wipe from right then we'll do here i believe there is some issue with it we need to remove this Let's remove it and we need to just, I believe this has not been it has not been grouped so we need to select it again and we need to go to home we need to arrange and we need to group it that's the reason it was not working earlier so we'll go here and we'll go to animations and we'll make it wipe and that would be from right to left and finally this one we want this zoom and this will come with it this will come after previous and this will come with previous so i think we are done let's try it go to slide so from current slide so this is what we do have now if we make it it will show the strength the weakness the opportunities and finally the threats so i believe you like this if you like it don't forget to subscribe this channel thanks for watching we'll see you in next video thanks for your time